this is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at amphiprotic species. In the previous video, we looked at these two reactions. In the top reaction, the ethanoic acid is donating a proton to the water molecule. In the bottom reaction, the water molecule is donating a proton to the ammonia. In the top reaction, the ethanoic acid, which is the proton donor, is the Bronsted-Larry acid, and the water, which is the proton acceptor, is the Bronsted-Larry base. In the bottom reaction, the water is the proton donor, therefore it's the Bronsted-Larry acid, and the ammonia is the proton acceptor, it's the Bronsted-Larry base. So in these two reactions, we have water acting as a Bronsted-Larry base, and water acting as a Bronsted-Larry acid. An amphiprotic species is a substance that can act as a Bronsted-Larry acid or Bronsted-Larry base. In the previous slide, we saw that water can act as a Bronsted-Larry base or a Bronsted-Larry acid. Therefore, water is an amphiprotic species. An amphiprotic species must be able to donate a proton to another species and also be able to accept a proton from another species. Let's look at another example of an amphiprotic species, which is the hydrogen carbonate ion HCO3 negative. In the top reaction, the hydrogen carbonate ion is donating a proton to the hydroxide ion. Therefore, it's acting as a Bronsted-Larry acid. In the bottom equation, the hydrogen carbonate ion is accepting a proton from the hydronium ion. Therefore, it's acting as a Bronsted-Larry base. In the top reaction, the conjugate base of the hydrogen carbonate ion is the carbonate ion, which is CO3 2 negative. In the bottom reaction, the conjugate acid of the hydrogen carbonate ion is H2CO3. Here are two more examples of amphiprotic species, the hydrogen sulfate ion, which is HSO4 negative, and the dihydrogen phosphate ion, which is H2PO4 negative. Both these examples can be found on the worksheet accompanying this video. Finally, I'd like to look at the difference between amphiprotic and amphoteric. Amphiprotic refers to any substance that can accept and donate a proton in the Bronsted-Larry theory of acids and bases. Amphoteric refers to any species that can act like an acid or a base. All amphiprotic species are also amphoteric. The term amphoteric can be applied in different theories of acids and bases, such as Lewis theory, where there is no proton transfer. 